I've spent considerable amount of time on HBCU campuses in the past 12 months, and that's only speeding up now, especially as we get into football season. This past week, I was at Howard University, and I had a really, really positive experience. And I think that if you take this one suggestion, you'll have an equally positive experience. I think you should consider going back to your alma mater and scheduling a campus tour. Now, you might be saying, well, I already know my campus. I've been on the campus. I I know it intrinsically. And I would challenge you to say you probably know it pretty well, but you don't know it all. I say that because I thought I knew it all. thought I had been to all the new buildings that had been renovated, and that's just not true. We got to go on a campus tour, and we got to see the future. Okay, you've seen this building gutted. You've seen that building gutted. Well, did you know that this building is currently empty? And it's empty because we're tearing down this portion of this building and we're building out here. And, oh, that department that's let's say school of communications that's no longer going to be there that's going to be in this other part of campus and oh yeah well the university just bought the land here and they're involved in a land lease with a developer and this is where the new dorms will be and they'll be done by 2024 i mean all that stuff is really impressive and as an alum it really will empower you to speak in an informed fashion about what's happening with your school, especially in this climate where anything bad happens or any even questionable reports get transmitted all over the internet at lightning speed. However, no good news travels fast. So it's just my challenge to you to go back. Ask for the tourist version. Take the tour and ask questions. I think you'll learn a lot and I think it will empower you to really represent that brand much better. It's my two cents for the day. I'm Brendan Moore. I hope you join me on 7.community.